How are you guys doing? Welcome back to episode 3 of Canuck Survival Series. Uh, here we are, back in the world. I'm looking this way because I don't want to show you guys just what I've been doing yet. Uh, what I've been doing just yet. That's uh, better English. Uh, but let's just go, I think. Uh, still, no new subscribers. Another shout out to him, Raiden Widmer. He's pretty cool. I've been talking to him lately. Uh, hope he's said uh, he's been enjoying the series so far. So make sure you guys check it out. Um, I don't think he has any videos, but I know he does videos with one of his friends. So, uh, be sure to check them out. And yeah, uh, you can see down here, one of the things I did is get some cows and sheep and stick them in a little hole in the ground. Yeah, we're gonna be putting, we're gonna be doing that in another episode. Uh, we're gonna be building a little area down there for them, but that's kind of a secret. Don't tell anyone that I told you. Uh, let's just go in, in here. Uh, the mine shaft, uh, we've been doing, we've all been doing a lot of mining. And I think you might have seen it through the window. But let's just go right on in here. Alright, so. This is what I've been doing between episodes. Uh, we're going to be working in here, this episode. Uh, so let me just start from, well, let me just start from over. Well, you guys saw in the last episode that we went to the nether. And I still got to put something behind there because that looks really strange. Um, but yeah, we have our chest. Uh, if you guys are wondering, that is how many diamonds I currently have. Uh, I just got back from a mining expedition. Uh, so that's that's all we got for now, but that's, that's a pretty good amount. Uh, that's the gold, and that's the iron. So, uh, my volume is really quiet. Uh, let's just crank that up a little bit. Alright, so you can see we got our full set of diamond armor. Uh, we got our full set of iron armor, as well as the iron armor that we are wearing. Uh, we're working on enchanting all this stuff, which I will show you next. I was playing around with banners, and yeah, I need a bit more practice with that. Uh, but I'm planning to do something pretty cool with those, but nah. This is our enchanting room. So you can see we've got all the bookshelves, little anvil up there. And yeah, level 30. And then I was just looking for something to do up here. And then I realized that we were right on the edge of the mountain. And so it just happened to work out that when we cut out this little section, uh, we get a nice, uh, a nice little balcony right up here with a pretty good view. Uh, not much different than our balcony over there, but hey, if, we got, if, we're over, if we're already up on a mountain, why not cut out a few holes and get a good view? Uh, this is just a little quick smelting, uh, smelting machine I have set up, uh, just automatic puts in coal and all that, and yeah. Uh, this whole area is just, uh, I'm just gonna leave it open for now. Don't really have any plans for it, this is just gonna be like the main entrance. I might try and put some stuff in, some stuff in here. Uh, treat it kind of maybe like a museum or something. I don't know, something cool. Uh, but for now, uh, or what we're going to be doing this episode anyway, is we are going to be put it, building in a grand staircase. So, uh, I have this pl somewhat planned out. Uh, I didn't do it in creative world. I just have an I, I have an image in my head of what I want to do. Uh, we're going to be putting it back there, and so it's going to be going down. I think uh, somewhere between five and ten blocks. Um, Probably 10, probably, probably closer to that, just because then that'll be give us a little bit, that's just a little bit longer, so it'll give us a better, I don't know, it'll look better. And yeah, we're going to start, we're going to have one start over here, uh, they're probably going to be 6 wide, because that, that'll be, because uh, we can make stairs out of these, this material, this material, and, well, it's all these two materials, so then we'll make it curve down like that, and then we'll line it with something else to make it look better. Uh, and yeah, we're gonna do that on both sides. And I hope we get. Uh, I'm not gonna time lapse that or anything, just because I think it's gonna be really boring. Um, I may. I'm gonna cut out this area first off, and then I will come back when we are when we're actually ready to start on the stairs. And yeah, we'll do a little bit of that building together. Um, it let, I'll let you guys see some of that. I may go into a creative world for a little bit and just get some ideas. I have the dimensions of this area somewhat. Uh, well, I know from that wall to the front doors is 20 blocks, so that was not actually planned out. It was just kind of ended up happening that way when I finished carving this area out. Uh, I'm not sure if I if it is from that wall to that wall, or that wall to the portal wall, the wall that the portal's in. Uh, but that doesn't really matter. Uh, we can figure that out pretty easily. But yeah, I will see you guys back in a little bit when I have this whole area carved out. 
Alrighty, and we are back. So you can see behind me, I dug out that whole hole, that I, or that whole big area that I showed you guys. Uh, all the way down, at least 12 blocks down. I'm just gonna get out of this view. Uh, there we go. And yeah, you can see over here, I kind of started on the design. I'm not too sure if I like this yet. I kind of want it to curve, like to, I want them to kind of meet in the middle, and this one's not moved going over enough. Um, so I'm thinking half slabs. Uh, you can see my inventory made a ton of stairs. And yeah, so I could be... I might just go with stairs, uh, and mix them, or more stair, or stairs slash half slabs. So like, at this area, I like... Ooh, the light spike with me. Uh, I like how this area, or this level right here, where it's got the stairs and the half slabs, same with here, those were kind of our transition levels. So I think I might do that actually all the way along, and then move each one over. Just because then, when you go down, yeah, let's actually just check out how that looks. Uh, we can do this pretty easily. Which means you have one more level we are going to have to tear out, but hey, whatever. No big deal. Um, so I believe that is a block. And then we have that there. And then we shut. And then... And this is why I put a ladder down here. Um, I've been falling and tripping and... Yeah, hopefully there's not enough mobs spawning in the area to cause any problems. Uh, yeah, we just go like that, and that, and that, and oh no, I fell down. Come on, come on. Ah, I didn't get it. Alright, well, more scaffolding. Uh, because we're using the scaffolding anyway in a little bit. Alright, well, I guess I'll shift up. This, yeah, that's, stairs are not fun to build with. Of course. Alright, well, I'm just gonna chop that out for now. Hey, we got it. Alright. And we've got to aim it on the bottom of the block. And so I believe uh, then you put a stair here. And then slab it there. Not those stairs, uh, just yet. Okay, there we go. Stones, stone brick slabs along there. Uh, and then we bring this one on the side. Okay, yeah, that'll give us a much more gradual... We're still getting the, st the steps and the uh, nice edging on the outside. So I'm going to tear this out uh, and put this in. And I'll show you guys uh, when I'm finished this side. If I'm happy with it, I'll show you guys. Uh, if not, uh, I'll just come back when I've got something that I'm happy with. But I'll see you guys in the next little bit. Alrighty, guys, and here we go. Finished off the staircase. Uh, you can see, oh, there, there's a little spoiler alert right there. Uh, okay. So we're just going to go up on here, and look down, ah, uh, you don't really get a good view of it, ah, uh, but let's just walk down. Yeah, this is our staircase right here. So, this is all I really planned for this episode, but uh, what we're going to do before we're gonna start working on next is the storage room, which we're going to be putting right in here. Let me just cut it, ah, uh, I lost a block, that's going to be nice. Alright, but yeah, we're going to put in a storage room right in here. And that works too, I guess. I really did not think this part's real. Okay. Uh, let's just put a little access doorway right here. But yeah, we're gonna have it so our... our this is gonna be our bulk storage, mainly. Uh, we're gonna have build a different storage area for all the small stuff, for like, quickly needed items. We're gonna build that somewhere else, but this is gonna be our storage area. So, I think I'm gonna have to do some mining. Um, because we're going to need a hopper. I'm planning to do, uh, just got to figure out cobble, dirt, gravel, and all these three other ones. So I'll probably make up like six silos or something like that. Uh, and then we'll start doing, we'll trip, maybe do, do like a piston, redstone, something door. Maybe kind of interesting. And then after that, I'll start working on the floor area and start working on the silos. Uh, but I'm going to go, I need to go collect some resources because you can see. Well, in here I don't have that much, and I'll just show you my iron supply. Yeah, we got a little bit. Not not too much. We're probably going to burn through all of that in this project. That's our diamond supply. Yeah, we died once, so. And lost all our stuff, so that's, that's no big deal. Uh, but anyway, I'll see you guys in the next clip. Alright guys, so we're going to start off by building our door in here. Uh, I haven't collected enough materials for the rest of the silos yet, but the doors we're ready to do. Uh, so... I tried to look up a fancy design for a 
two by three door, and this is the I just going with what I can do. So let's just go on in here. Uh, I can put one extra block, whatever. And yeah, that's all you got to do. Uh, next thing, torch. And I own some scaffolding right here. I'll put that up there, and then jump in place. And there we go. You can see all three are activated on that side. This is an extremely easy design. This is nothing that you need to look up on YouTube. It's just basic Minecrafting skills. Uh, then we're gonna have, we want to have this piston or pressure blade activated. That's what I'm trying to say. Uh, so we'll just drop down here. I believe. Yeah. Okay. Da, da, da. And then you can place that on there. It looks like it's lit up, but it's actually... Actually, I should check that. I don't think it shouldn't be lit up. And I'm putting these blocks in front of me. Ah, whatever works. Uh, yeah, there you go. You can see it's not lit up. So let's go and put the redstone in on the other side. And then we'll drop that down one more. Actually, that will look better that way. Alright, we'll put that down there. And then we just gotta build a platform. Uh, let me see around here. I'll put a platform right in here. And in here. Get rid of all this. Because we can't get onto it right now. And throw that on there. Put our back shit. I don't know if that's centered on our door or not. Should be. Looks like it is. I, don't know. I guess we'll find out. Uh, so now we'll head up our nice little ladder. And put down our pressure plate, and you should see, bam! Bam! There we go. Alright, there's a nice quick tutorial on the door. Uh, not really a tutorial. We need more pressure plates for it though, so I'm gonna go, let's go up here and make a couple more. And I still gotta put, actually put the blocks in. And there we go. So I'm gonna let you guys know that I'm not a redstone master, I'm not that good with redstone. I like using it because it makes things easier, but I'm not gonna spend a lot of time trying to figure it out. So this, this is this is not nearly as advanced as I've gotten. Like I I can do tree farms, I can do wither farms. I've built all those in the past, but this is nice and simple. This is what I like. And then yeah, we'll go cover this up as well. Put some up there too. And I believe yeah. So we got this nice little corridor. Whatever could be down here with pressure plates. Oh uh, yeah, we're gonna have to we're gonna have to change this up, make it look a little bit better. Get some of the cracked slash mossy stone bricks in here. Cause right now it just kind of looks it's kind of obvious that it's something. Okay, I'm just being entertained by running through it right now and hearing the pistons. I'm hoping the audio is recording, because that'd be alright, so anyway. Uh, I'm gonna start, I'm gonna work on this area more. Uh, I gotta cut back, you can see this is, if I go... Well, you can just see the, that's the floor up there of our main area. So we have, we have about, uh, four blocks? Yeah, four blocks to play with right, right here. Which is the same height as our, uh, level up there. Uh, so we're just gonna, I'm gonna carve out a little area over here. Uh, get us ready, redstone ready over here. Um, maybe start working on the silos. But I'll do that with you guys on camera, and but I'll see you in that next clip. Alright guys, here we go. So, you can see here, I added a little bit of a pattern to the floor. I'm just going to extend this out just a little bit. Uh, I was getting kind of bored of just the plain old boring, and I did that one wrong. I'm gonna get it, get it. Ah. Alright, well, I'm going to have to jump down and get that in a minute. Or, after I'm done this. Alright, let's grab that. I know it was only one piece, and I gave up two hearts for it, but hey, no big deal, no big deal at all. Uh, so yeah, this is going to be our room uh, that we're going to be building in, or this is going to be our bulk storage area. Uh, so my plan for this uh, is to have these, um, I don't know if silo is the right word, uh, but I'll show you guys in just a second when I finish up the floor what my plan is. So, uh, why do I keep screwing up? It's a, hey, at least that time I didn't actually jump down intentionally. Alright, uh, so let's see. It's getting kind of dark in here. Alright, let's get torches in here. Get that one off the wall, because it's annoying me. So you can see it's... I'm planning to put it back pretty far. Um, I'm not ready. I don't... I only have 170 uh, blocks left on my pick. 
I don't know if that's changed by the Unbreaking 3. I'm pretty sure it is, but whatever. Uh, so yeah, my plan is what I want to do. My plan, yeah, my plan is what I want to do. Um, so. And there's something really weird happening outside my house right now. It sounds like a lawnmower or something's going crazy. Uh, I apologize if you guys can hear it, but I shouldn't be able to. The microphone on my headset is pretty good. So, um, yeah. Uh, we're going to start off. So this is going to be our first chest. So this is going to be... So this is... Uh, we should cut out the rest of this section. Alrighty, we're just... Uh, this should be just about big enough. Alright then, so then what we're going to have is... This is going to... How is this? Oh yeah, we don't have much room to play with up there. Uh, we might actually, let's see, can we, if we drop this down, I don't want to drop this all down one, never mind, what am I talking about? Um, yeah, so we might just end up having a three high roof here, like we have right in here. That still seems high, plenty high enough. Uh, so yeah, what we're going to have is we're going to have that there. So this chest is going to have a hopper under this side. I didn't think I would get it. Uh, let me just go down here. What we're going to do is over... And that's definitely not what I wanted to do in any of the cases. Alright, so we're gonna knock that one out, and we should be able to do what I want. There we go, yeah, we can still do it. Unless I take the, the block out, yeah. Hey, whatever. We, we got time, we got dirt. Alright, so yeah, we're gonna have that on there. And then they're gonna have the hopper under here. So then we're gonna come up, throw in our cobblestone. We're not gonna have, actually... Actually, I'm rethinking this now. I'm thinking if we just have one chest we could throw all our bulk items into. We just walk right in here and there's a chest. Oh, that's so entertaining. Uh, but we have a chest right in the middle here. Uh, we just throw... Because I was thinking my plan was to have a chest and then it's bulk storage beside it. Chest and it's bulk storage beside it. Chest, bulk storage beside it. And that was moving really fast. Uh, but no, I think I'm actually... I've never... I haven't really done too much with automatic sorting systems, but hey, I think that'd be kind of, I don't know, that'd be something cool to kind of play with. Maybe I'll have to look something up on YouTube. I've built them before, but never on this scale, so I don't I don't know, we'll see. Uh, so yeah, uh, we'll have it one, two, three, just for ease, easy, or ease, of, just for ease of use, that's what I'm trying to, that's, that's the word I'm trying to get at. I'm uh, gonna put the chests, uh, how many in was I counting? One, two, three, four, and on the fifth one in. Actually, we'll put it on the sixth. Um, I think I'm just gonna take this ladder out temporarily. Move it over. Uh, those are our ladders, those are our fences. Uh, okay, we'll just, yeah, we'll just put the ladders in here for now. There we go, nice and easy. Uh, and then we'll patch this up so we don't fall through it, because I know if we leave that open. Uh, same with this spot, we're gonna fall right through that. And that is an axe, not a pick. And we'll put that on there. Uh, okay, I just wanna see how this looks. We have this right in the middle. So we'll do that. And then around the outside. Cool. Alright, so yeah, this is gonna actually that is a little far away. Alright, let's just uh let's just see what we can I kind of want space, yeah, okay, I think if we have two in, because then we still have space to walk around, or we can just come in and full throw over it. So yeah, I think that uh, we'll do that. Uh, we'll put the hopper, and we're going to have to go down here and do the whole scaffolding thing again. That up, and over, and over. Hey, I didn't, I've never noticed they put sound in for when you climb ladders. Uh, we'll put that there, and I think uh, what we'll do, I know this is it, this is just for the looks, honestly. Uh, of course. I don't, know if we could, I don't know if we can do this, actually. Oh, we did it. Uh, for Minecraft professional. No, but that's, that's just for the looks. Uh, it is kind of detrimental, because it fills up. Why does it? Oh, okay, it is coming straight down. Okay, I thought it was into the block. But anyway, uh, so yeah, that is detrimental. It does, it doesn't slow it down too much. It doesn't really have that much of an effect. But it's, this hopper doesn't do anything. It's kind of a waste, is why it's detrimental. But hey, that's that's no big deal. It lo that looks better if you have that gray trim rather than gray and brown and all that. 
So the next thing we're gonna have, uh, so we decide we're gonna, we wanna have a two wide walkway. So let's tear this back one more. So I'm just carving out the actual room right now. So I, I just want to build everything around the room and then fit the redstone to it. Because uh, the redstone shouldn't be anything too bad. It's just going to be hoppers and more chests and a couple droppers. Because we're going to put in item elevators and all that. Um, still don't know. I kind of want to use the... I don't, actually, no, we don't, we don't have found any winter snow or ice biomes or anything. So that might be that one of the things we have to go on an expedition for find some compact ice, uh, but anyway, we don't have that right now, so we might just use uh, simple dropper item elevators. Those I have used quite a bit on other Minecraft, other times I've played Minecraft, so they're pretty easy. So we've got our two wide here, and then our first one, I guess, will just be the cobblestone all the way along here, and then we'll put uh, slabs or stairs or something. Actually, I think we actually have some on us. No, we do not. I know I threw them in a chest up here, so let's just go take a look. So I'm also thinking, I believe we have uh, quite a... I'm just gonna, we're just gonna do a quick check here. Alright, well that's all I wanted to show. Uh, we do have a ton of space over here, so we might, we're gonna put a uh, storage area right, about right here. So all this kind of storage that we have here, uh, we do have our, still our bulk storage in here. But, yeah, uh, extra torch for randomly. Uh, I'm looking for the slabs. The, if nothing else, oh, okay, I can't thought that was. Um, whatever, we'll just make some more. We, we got supplies. And I should close these doors. So another thing, oh, that's a furnace. Okay, um, we'll throw that in there. We'll just make a nice even number of them. So I don't know if I showed this in the last episode when I said I would reveal it. I showed it at the beginning. Uh, this is the new skin, if you guys are, in, are wondering. So I did design this myself. Uh, it's not perfect. If any of you are really good at designing skins, uh, go ahead and I'll use it. If you just design it, I'll probably use it. Uh, I'm going for the military look here. This is the Mar style of Marpad style of camouflage. And it's, I don't know why I put the CT on the back, but like having an awesome tattoo on the back yeah why not and yeah let's put our armor back on before we get killed by some random thing and yeah if you guys are wondering i do have a plan for this this whole large area um i've actually got some cool ways for the corners uh but we're gonna pull it back or push pull push whatever you want to say uh we're gonna push it back quite a ways uh but we might wait to do that until we get a beacon uh, that might be what we start working on in the next episode, is getting a beacon. Because I do, this this pick is, I'm breaking 3 efficiency 5, and it's, it, it's painful. It's, I put a movie on, or I put some music on, and I just go for an hour or two, and it, it, it sucks. I will, I will tell you that fully honestly, it sucks doing it. Uh, so let's go get, let's just go grab some more wood. But yeah, um... Let me just see. So, some other things that maybe you may have noticed are going on the channel. I think I tweeted it out a couple, well, I think almost a week ago now. Uh, I wanted, I'm thinking about doing a Flashback Friday. Uh, I recently just bought the Lego Hobbit game just because I saw it on Steam and it was on a pretty, it was on a really good sale. It was only five bucks. It's like I, I always loved the the Lego games. I played the Lord of the Rings, Star Wars. I forget the Lego, the Lego Movie one. That one. That one was disappointing. Oh, that one was very disappointing. Uh, so we won't be playing that one for sure. Uh, and that's that. Wow. Okay. Um, I may have to go collect some wood. But yeah. So uh, if you guys want to see the Lego games, um, I was having. I wanted to put a little teaser on April Fools for that because that, there's this one really weird scene in the Lego Hobbit, but it wasn't recording properly. So I have to look into that. I think I may have found the problem, and I have wood in here somewhere. You can see I'm, I like to be organized, but I can't be organized with this. So yeah, and I don't like using anything but oak. Actually, I don't use jungle, so we got a stack of that. Yeah, I don't. I don't. I don't actually know. This is the first time I've seen really, really seen jungle wood in a while, and I actually kind of like the color. It's pretty nice. Ah, uh, 37. Okay, that should be more than enough. 
Uh, let's just take a look outside. Oh, it's night. Uh, I'm going to be changing this into glass panes as well as soon as I finally get a silk touch pick. And same with all these. Uh, those ones are going to stay full blocks just because they look better. Full blocks look better on a corner. And yeah, let's uh, close that up too. This is our view if you guys are wondering. I don't know if I showed you guys my... Oh yes, I did. I did show you guys my animal pen at the beginning of this episode. It's not animal cruelty. I'm going to be moving them. I told you guys that already. I believe that I'm going to be moving them into a better area. We're going to be working on that next episode, actually. Um, I also want thinking about uh, these episodes. They do take quite a bit of work to make. Uh, but I'm thinking of two a week. Because uh, right now, I don't think I'm putting... Between City Skylines and this, I just don't think I'm putting out enough content for you guys. So I, I know I only have one subscriber so far. Uh, but I'm not complaining about that, but if you guys want to see more content, or if you're somebody that's just checking out my videos for the first time, and you think, oh, this guy's pretty good, I would like to see more of his content, let me know, and I will try and, uh, I'll do, put, probably put more effort. Uh, my only problem is, though, is that I'm still, in Canada, we, or, well, in Alberta, where I live, is, uh, we have, um, the grade school, so I think for, Amer I'm not sure how it works in America, even though I know most of my views don't come from the U.S., uh, but we have we have uh, grades one through twelve, and so I'm currently in grade twelve, finishing off. So I've got these. Alberta is the only province in Canada where we have 50% uh, diploma exams. That's right, one test. So for me, I currently am taking English and Social Studies. Uh, they are. I do. I spend two hours, or maybe four hours. Yeah, actually no, I think between, because you have a essay and uh, multiple choice test for each, it's somewhere around four hours, and yeah, that determines 50% of my grade. It's it's not fun, but they're getting rid of that next year, of course, after I've already graduated, but that's no big deal. It's, it's a stressful test, but everybody can do it, really. Well, not everyone, but uh, yeah. Um, what, uh, let's see, let's, this is actually looking really good. Uh, I like, like, uh, using the slabs, this is, it's gonna be saving on, saving on some resources. Uh, did we, oh, we didn't put it back there, oh, we did put it back there on that one. Uh, I can't see back there. And good. And I don't think, okay, I did, and I just put a solid roof over there, okay. Uh, okay, that, that's actually looking really good, because then we can, uh, what we can do, we can just label that what each section is, and you can tell it's not going to be a big room. So over here, we're going to have, for example, we're going to have like, I don't know, I don't have any dirt, okay? And here we're going to have, wow. And here we're going to have cobble, and then over here we might have andesite and diorite and all that, and then gravel probably around here. Uh, but then what we're going to be doing on the back side? Let me just, where's that dirt? I'll just put the cobble in there for now. On the back side, uh, we're, this is your, this part you're never going to see, uh, except for when I'm building it. But yeah, we're just gonna have hoppers that are gonna go up. Uh, we're gonna have the uh, whatever it's called, the item elevator will come up this stack right here. We'll get put into that one. It'll fill up that, or I believe, no, yeah, it'll fill up. It'll go down to the bottom, fill up, and I think that's how it should. I don't know. I'm not too sure anymore. Uh, I'm just trying to think because I kind of want I want the top chest to fill up, or like I want to fill up from the top down, but I'm not sure that's fair. That's exact. That is exactly possible. Because um, I kind of want to. I, I would like to extend this down, like way, way down. So I know there's a way you can make like an infinite silo almost. So it. Uh, well, actually, no, that wouldn't work either. Where it fills when the when it gets empty at the top, the bottom it refills it. Uh, but I think what we could have, actually... Well, I don't know, this is gonna, this again, this is gonna be bulk storage, so if there's chests all the way down to the bottom, I don't really, I don't really care all that much. And if I need to, I'll have, I'll put a ladder in here, and then when I need something, if top, if it's not filled up to here, then I'll just go down to the bottom and grab it. Uh, but yeah, I, you guys can tell in my inventory, I do need, before we get into all this redstone stuff, uh, actually, let's get a... Hey, good, we have some junk wood. All right, uh, let's get a couple hoppers, a couple, uh, a few more. Let's just burn through this iron. I don't like doing that, but... Eh. Oh, that's painful. Okay. Um, 
may have to do a little bit more scaffolding. And well, yeah, let's just kind of set ourselves a way out of a nice area to work with. There we go. And yeah, we're definitely going to need more than just three chests. So especially since this is our bulk storage, we, almost, we have almost, I think, four chests up there of just cobblestone. So yeah, these are, these are going to extend all the way down, so I'm going to put like a glass floor. Actually, yeah, that'll, that'll look really cool if we have a uh, glass here, uh, just all the way down, and I'm going to end up falling in this, I just know. Uh, let's see. Yeah, we, what we could do, we can put chests all the way down here. Uh, we'll put them down pretty pretty deep, actually. And then we'll just have a ladder that we need them, because I don't, I don't use cobblestone that much. Uh, oh yeah, I'm going to need one for uh, smooth stone, too, in the future, so maybe that one, we'll just put that one right at the front. Uh, so overall this project, it's looking like we're going to be needing, uh, let me just think. Uh, we're going to need a sorting system, some way to move the items up. But yeah, uh, we may end up doing this and finishing this off in the next episode because I'm just looking at my time where this clip alone is around 20 minutes. So yeah, we may actually run out of time. Uh, I'll definitely put at least one more clip in and I'll let you guys see what progress I've gotten done. Uh, but I'm going to finish this off and I will see you guys in the next clip. Alright guys, here we are again. Uh, you can see uh, I finished, uh, well I didn't do the roof over there yet just because I want to leave that open for any redstone we need. Uh, but I did finish up this corridor a little bit. Uh, I'm leaving this open for expansion for now because again we only have the six items. But you can see there's glass there. And you can see there's a couple chests down there. If we walk up to the glass, whoa look at all that. That is, a, that is what I call bulk storage. So basically I'm thinking, I can't decide if I want to try and do like a slime block elevator down, a minecart elevator down, something, or just a simple ladder. I don't know, that's, that's not nearly as cool. But we do have this four, four wide area on both sides, so probably will be something cool there. I don't know, just, just hinting at something. Uh, but anyway, I talked way too much in that last clip, and yeah, I managed to burn through all the time. Uh, I'm sorry if you guys don't like the talking. I can just let me know down in the comments if you want me to get rid of that, not talk so stinking much. Uh, but yeah, this is going to do it for this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, let's just, oh, actually, uh, so that we did in this episode, all we did, uh, if you want, just skip the beginning parts. For some reason, I don't know why you do that. Uh, but we did the storage area, and yeah, um, then the big project, in case you guys skipped a lot of it, uh, is a staircase. So I'll just show this off again. This took a long time because again I covered out this whole area. I don't know the exact dimensions. I know it's 14 deep by 30 by 20 I think? Yeah. I know that th that the width is 20, the height is 14. And I did that all with this pick right here. Yeah, it took a little while. Uh, but it was definitely worth it. If you look at the, if you look out here, we get this great view of gray 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 and more gray i would make some joke there but i don't think i'm gonna bring that up anyway uh, i'm sure some of you got are thinking the same thing i am uh but anyway i hope you guys enjoyed this episode and i will see you in the next one